BMD is a new asphalt mix design and uh, acceptance system uh, that rely on mixture performance tests to ensure the asphalt mixtures are going to have good resistance to rutting, cracking, and moisture damage. I said new uh, because it is different from what we are using, uh, which is a super paid mix design, because BMD focuses more on using those performance tests rather than the volumetric analysis. I think there are lots of benefits associated with implementing BMD, uh, and I like to you know, group them into like three categories. The first one I'll say is performance. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, that you know, BMD focuses on performance testing using those mechanical tests that correlate well to field performance. Balanced Mix Design offers a safeguard to make sure the asphalt mixture that we design going to perform well in the field. With that being said, it has the opportunity to extend the lifespan and longevity of our asphalt payments. The second benefit I would say is innovation. Uh, because of the focus of Balanced Mix Design on performance-driven end product testing, it allows, and more importantly, motivates asphalt contractors to think outside of the box, to be more creative with material selection and production operations. A good example of that will be the responsible use of locally available materials and recycled asphalt materials, which will provide significant economic and environmental benefits without affecting performance. The last category I would say is cost savings. Um, you know, to me, uh, Balanced Mix Design offers a platform uh, for asphalt contractors, just like a buffet table, where there are so many different mix design options on that buffet table that we can use to achieve the performance perspective. But at the end of the day, our industry still operates in a low bid environment. That means like that will challenge them to look through the different approaches available to find the one that's gonna be the most cost effective. Uh, I would say the best resource on how to get ready and how to do the implementation in a responsive manner uh, is follow the guide that NCAD put together in NCHRP 10107. Uh, what we put there uh, is pretty much like a roadmap for how to implement the balance mix design. The first couple of steps is to talk about the benefits or the motivations for balance mix design, to understand the why. And then you need to start the overall planning process, you know, to have a timeline in mind saying like how long we're going to do it and what are the anticipated outcome we like to achieve at the end of this journey. And after that, you know, it goes into kind of like the technical side of this implementation journey to look into like to select the performance test, okay, to purchase equipment, and also like to establish your baseline data, and more importantly, to develop some preliminary criteria. And those are the steps that are very time consuming and probably the most important part through the process, okay? Once you have those preliminary criteria, this is where we can start developing provisional specifications on balanced mix design and use those special provisions to conduct pilot projects. At the same time, the agency will need to either develop or update their existing like a training uh, accreditation program to support the use of performance test for balanced mix design. And after all these steps are completed, this is where like we can initiate the implementation process. And also along that process, you know, we can make adjustments to the previous steps for improvement. Well, there are lots of good information on the internet, but sometimes it can be overwhelming. Uh, I'll suggest to start with Napa BMD Resource Guide website, uh, which has lots of good background information. The best part of that website, in my opinion, is the information on the implementation status among state highway agencies. I would also highly recommend FHWA, uh, Capri, uh, and NCAT. Uh, they all have lots of good information about the BMD development and implementation, and also there's good information on the training opportunities that's related to BMD.